Imagine the collective reaction when Elon Musk revealed that a brand new Tesla would arrive. For just us, 8.989 it wasn't clickbait. It wasn't a prank. It was real. An electric car from the most provocative brand in the automotive industry for less than many popular combustion engine models. It was as if someone had thrown a stone into the pond, creating ripples that hit all the competition, from BYD to Toyota, from Volkswagen to GM. The Model 2 wasn't born just to compete. It was born to provoke a controlled collapse of the concept of affordable car. And the key to this feat lies in something much deeper than just price. The first piece of the puzzle is production engineering. While rivals still rely on hundreds of welded parts, the Model 2 is molded with 62,000-ton gigapresses, capable of fusing the car's structure with near-surgical precision and speed. This reduces cost, assembly time, and failure points. When you think about how to make a high-end car cost almost the same as a high-powered motorcycle, the secret isn't just in the materials. It's in how these parts come to life within the production line. With robots that seem to dance, operating in harmony with optimization algorithms that never rest. But for this price to become a reality, the game isn't just technical, it's also political and strategic. Tesla is relying on state incentives, such as tax credits and exemptions for electric vehicles that vary from country to country. In the United States, this can mean up to $7,500 discount directly in the final price. In other words, the consumer pays less, not because the car is worth less, but because the government is also interested in this energy transition. Elon Musk understood this and put together a puzzle where mass production, public policy, and aggressive marketing fit together with millimeter precision. And when we talk about mass production, we're talking about a global scale. Texas, Berlin, Shanghai, Mexico, these are the foundations that underpin the Model 2 production plan. The goal is bold, 5 million units per year by 2020. The Texas Gigafactory alone is already operating with three gigapresses capable of assembling 1-200 cars per day. The idea isn't to produce for niches, it's to capture the market center. It's to make the Model 2 available on every street corner, garage, highway, and ride-hailing app. This level of production also allows for something that few can bring the price down without sacrificing quality. This is because large-scale iteration, when done with advanced robotics, reduces costs without necessarily compromising delivery. It's unlike a cheap car made the old-fashioned way, where everything feels fragile and improvised. The Model 2 is born from an industrial logic where quality is programmed by software and monitored in real time, with levels of precision that would put a Swiss watchmaker to shame. And all this without creating a minimalist Frankenstein that cuts out the essentials. The car still carries the Tesla flagship DNA, with a futuristic design, refined aerodynamics, and a structure designed for safety and energy efficiency. It doesn't have the same luxury as a Model S, of course, but it's far from being a bare-bones car. The proposal is bold, to deliver a complete, functional and intelligent electric car for a price that seemed impossible just two years ago. Interestingly, the Model 2 also attacks a strategic point in consumer behavior, the desire to belong. It's not just a cheap car, it's a cheap Tesla. The weight of the brand carries status, innovation and aspirational desire. This, in itself, changes the marketing game. What was once an elite product now becomes a gateway to a new lifestyle, like the iPhone SE of the automotive industry. Compact, affordable, yet still premium in feel. This move is causing competitors to panic. After all, how do you react to a vehicle that not only breaks the $10,000 barrier, but also bears the emblem of one of the most sought-after companies in the world? The answer, for many, is to play catch-up. But when Tesla takes this kind of step, it's not just opening a new segment. It's closing the door to others before they realize they've fallen behind. This is where the Model 2 starts to feel more like a piece of science fiction than an affordable car. 
It only really sinks in when you discover that it's equipped with systems that, until now, were restricted to laboratory prototypes or futuristic concepts displayed at auto shows. No ostentation. The secret lies in how these technologies are quietly integrated into the user experience. The car doesn't stand out for its exaggeration, but for the fact that seems to know what you need before you even ask. And that's not a metaphor. It's literally what he does. A good example of this is the System Flow Tread Adaptive Traction. We're not talking about ordinary all-wheel drive. What the Model 2 delivers is AI-driven grip control. While competitors still react when the car starts to slide, the Model 2 anticipates the problem. Its sensors embedded in the tires detect micro-variations in friction and communicate this information to the car's brain 10 times per second. This allows for real-time torque adjustment, distributed with surgical precision between the wheels. The result? Cornering with 30% more stability and 85% less skidding on wet surfaces. It's not just traction, it's smart grip. This level of control is a game changer in everyday situations, from a wet road to a gravel driveway uphill. While other cars spin, the Model 2 simply moves forward, as if glued to the ground. It feels like driving a premium car, but with an electronic brain that never blinks. And most impressively, it does this subtly, without requiring the driver to know what's going on. The car simply adapts, and that's it. But the Model 2 doesn't stop there. Enter the Neural Sync, a system that goes beyond voice recognition. It analyzes your behavior patterns, your micro-expressions, your breathing rate, your grip on the steering wheel. In a matter of minutes, it begins to predict your intentions. Stressed, it dims the interior lights and plays a relaxing playlist. Sleepy, it increases the ventilation and makes the room cooler. It's not programming. It's adaptive learning in real time. And what's really impressive is the accuracy. After 10 miles of driving, the system achieves 92% accuracy in predicting user preferences. Comparisons with other vehicles are inevitable, while cars like the BYD Siegel or the VW ID. Two still operate with manual controls and rigid interfaces. The Model 2 acts like an invisible co-pilot who gets to know you better with every kilometer. The closest thing to this, perhaps, is in luxury cars that cost five times as much. But even these models don't have a system that constantly updates itself based on your emotional state. And if the exterior is surprising, the interior makes you rethink the concept of cabin. Thanks to the system's smart pod, the Model 2 can transform, literally. We're not talking about reclining seats. We're talking about a modular cabin with eight distinct configurations, from a mobile office with a retractable table to a mini movie theater for family trips. Everything can be configured in less than 10 minutes without tools. It's the kind of feature that eliminates the need for two cars, one for work and one for leisure. Modularity goes beyond comfort. It responds to real life. One day, you need to carry a collapsible crib. The next, you're going to pick up construction materials. Then, you need a quiet, well-ventilated place to work. With SmartPod, the Model 2 stops being a car and becomes an extension of your lifestyle. It's a hub on wheels. And the curious thing is that no competing automaker offers anything remotely similar in the same price range, not even in concept vehicles. This solves a classic dilemma for many families, the need for multiple cars for different purposes. With the Model 2, a single platform serves a variety of profiles, from college students to small business owners. Tesla seems to have understood that for an affordable car to have a real impact, it needs be everything at the same time, without appearing generic. The result is a multifunctional utility vehicle that understands that people change and that their vehicles should change with them. And best of all, none of this is technical hype or empty marketing. These are functional features in production, already being tested by real drivers. This completely changes the relationship the public can have with a popular electric car. 
It's no longer a choice based on economy or environmental awareness. It becomes an emotional decision. And that's where the Model 2 shows its true power. The world is changing and fast. Floods that were once considered rare events now recur every season. Extreme heat, unseasonable snow, violent storms. It sounds like something out of a movie, but it's become routine. And amidst this chaotic landscape, having a car that can handle the pressure is no longer a luxury, it's a necessity. The Tesla Model 2 fits right in, a car made to survive on an increasingly unpredictable planet. And that's no exaggeration. It offers practical solutions that leave even luxury SUVs looking unprepared. Starting with the system hydro lift, which anticipates flooded areas. As soon as sensors detect water on the road, the car automatically raises its suspension by up to 5 inches in half a second. This increases ground clearance from 7 inches to an impressive 12 inches. It may seem like a technical detail, but this difference allows the Model 2 to wade through up to 30 centimeters of water without compromising the engine, battery, or electrical system. In cities with frequent flooding, this completely changes the logic of where you can and cannot drive. And speaking of protection, what protects the soul of the car, the battery, is the Climate Core Shield, a thermal layer made of graphene that maintains performance even in extreme temperatures. While many vehicles lose up to 35% of their range in extreme cold or scorching heat, the Model 2 remains stable between 30 degrees and 50 degrees. In other words, it doesn't matter whether you're driving in the Alaskan winter or the Cuiaba summer. Efficiency remains intact, and the driver doesn't even notice the effort the system is putting in behind the scenes. This thermal shielding isn't just protection, it's energy intelligence. When the weather fluctuates significantly, the battery tends to experience accelerated wear, but the climate core helps maintain the ideal temperature to extend the cell's lifespan. And here's another difference. The battery is IP69K rated, a military standard. This means it can be submerged for up to 45 minutes in 1.2 meters of water without failing. And this kind of resistance is typically only found in extreme or military-grade vehicles. In the Model 2, it comes standard. Now, imagine that on top of all this, the car also has an energy plan B Solar Skin, optional, is a photovoltaic layer integrated into the vehicle's roof. It's not a traditional solar panel. It's a thin, elegant, and discreet film that captures up to 100 watts per day, even under cloudy skies. This provides an extra 6 to 7 kilometers of range per day, enough to avoid being stranded if the city's power goes out or the charging network is overloaded. In an emergency, this detail can be the difference between being stranded or arriving safely. The proposal here is clear. Energy independence and total resilience. While other EVs become hostage to infrastructure, the Model 2 creates its own path. Even in a post-storm scenario, with no power on the streets and floodwaters everywhere, the car keeps running. What's more, it keeps communicating, updating, and adapting. This ability to operate even in extreme situations makes the Model 2 something close to an urban survival vehicle. And this becomes even more relevant when you look at the statistics. Extreme weather events have increased by more than 80% in the last 20 years. Urban infrastructure, on the other hand, hasn't kept pace with this growth. The result? Millions of drivers facing real risks on their daily commutes. With a car that adapts and protects itself, this reality changes. The Model 2 doesn't force you to choose between comfort and safety. It delivers both, even in adverse scenarios. Furthermore, the combination of hydrolift, climate core, and solar skin forms a durable three-piece system that doesn't require constant maintenance. There are no complicated gears or parts exposed to corrosion. Everything is designed to last. And these aren't just generic promises. Tesla has tested these systems in extreme conditions. Ice, dust, water, salt, heat. And the numbers speak for themselves. Less wear, less risk of breakdown, 
and more service life in the field. This robustness creates a new kind of relationship with the car. It stops being a means of transportation and becomes a sophisticated survival tool, something ready for the unexpected, from a power outage to the end of a paved road. And this feeling of being prepared, of being in control even when the world outside seems to be losing its way, is perhaps what makes the Model 2 most appealing to a generation that knows the future won't be smooth sailing. Many people's image of an affordable car is one of a simple, cramped vehicle with only enough room for the basics and no special attention to comfort. But the Model 2 shatters that expectation from the first glance inside. No rough finishes or entry-level feel. The interior space is impressive, 10 cubic feet, and it's not just a pretty number on the spec sheet. This translates into more leg room, more elbow room, more freedom to move. Something that makes all the difference for both large families and those over 60 who no longer have the patience for a cramped car. One of the highlights here is the Flex Cabin, a modular cabin design that requires no tools or effort to change the seating configuration. Want more luggage space? You can fold the seats in seconds. Need to carry two child seats? There's plenty of room, with real comfort for adults too. With 41 inches of rear seat legroom, the Model 2 dwarfs competitors like the Chevrolet Bolt or Nissan Leaf on the inside, even though they're larger on the outside. And accessibility was not left out. The system CareMate, it was clearly designed with care by those who understand that not everyone is young and flexible. The seats automatically lower to an ideal height for those with knee or back problems. This, combined with doors that open 80 degrees, allows you to get in and out of the car without the crazy gymnastics. For those who care for elderly parents or have small children, this isn't a detail. It's the kind of functionality that changes your routine. Another little discussed but essential point in family cars is practicality in small gestures. In the Model 2, even this has been taken seriously. The voice command system achieves 95% accuracy across over 50 different commands. This means you can adjust the air conditioning, open the trunk, or change the music without taking your hands off the wheel or having to yell at the car. It's a layer of comfort that simplifies everyday use and prevents distractions, especially important when there are children or elderly people on board. And speaking of safety, the Model 2 goes beyond five stars. The System Guardian Eye monitors the car's interior with breathing and heart rate sensors. If a child or pet is accidentally left inside the car, the system sends an alert within five seconds to the owner's smartphone, activates the live interior camera, and automatically regulates the climate to keep the interior at 20, 20 degree feet. This isn't luxury. It's tragedy prevention, with technology that acts before anything happens. And it doesn't stop there. The rear trunk has 20 cubic feet, and the front, the famous frunk, has another six. That's more than many SUVs offer. The cabin also features hidden modular niches for storing everything from school bags to groceries without cluttering everything. When traveling, every inch counts. And here, space is used intelligently. There's no wasted volume, no unnecessary curves in the interior design. Everything feels like it was made for real people, with real lives. This concern for everyday life is what transforms the Model 2 into a car that can replace two or even three different vehicles in a family. Whether it's taking the mother-in-law to the doctor, picking up the kids from school, or transporting work tools, the car adapts. No fuss, no drama. It's as if it were designed by someone who truly understands what it's like to live in the real world, full of simultaneous commitments and unexpected events at every turn. And when it comes to longevity, the Model 2's structure lives up to its name. The chassis Monaco, made of aluminum with carbon nanotubes, is 52% lighter than standard steel, yet more durable.